Yes guys, Narbox has a new update. I'm gonna check it out now. So as you could see in the intro, what they're bringing now to the Narbox is a file manager. What we're gonna do today is test it out and see if it's actually worth it, if you should update. I also didn't bring anything. I didn't bring a laptop or stuff like that. I just wanted to test out if we can use the Narbox like it's supposed to, since it's getting a little bit too windy for my taste. Let's do this inside. Welcome back guys, now we're inside here. You see a little bit different things. I got some new line and got a new lens on there. It's a little bit more wide. Yes, you can see that. Let's put it like that. Something really cool about this is that you can now use drives more than 128 gigabytes, which is pretty essential for every photographer and every videographer and everybody out there since well these are just old drives from me laying around storing, storing all of my footage and I mean those are already more than one terabyte each. It really opens up a whole new workflow. And with that we can go through all of the folders and all of the files which are on those drives making backups securely and making them how you want to make them. Also if you're using list view you don't have to wait anymore for all the indexing to happen. And if you own a Narbox, you know what I mean. It takes a lot of time to do that, especially if you're like me, you have tons of footage stored on those little SD cards. So this weekend I took the drone out for a spin. Uh, we went to the beach, did some shots on the rocks. I think, I think they look really cool. I haven't seen them yet. So really crossing fingers on this one. And what we're gonna do is just having a four point setup. So we have the drone and the SD card, we have our phone, we have the Narbox and an other external hard drive. So all the stuff that's on the drone, I wanna copy that using the Narbox and my phone and put it on my hard drive. We have our micro SD card in the slot and we also have our hard drive around here. Now the cool stuff is that now we can choose between list view and thumbnail view. So if we still would want to check out the drive, I wanna see all of the stuff that's on the SD card. You can still do that just as before, but what we also can do is go into list view, go in there and see all the folders and all the files that are on here. So now let's just select one of the drone images that we are going to transport to the other drive. So not the Narbox, it's the external hard drive that we choose. And then we can choose between a date time folder or create a new one, which is the thing we want to do here. Then we got to name it. So for this one, let's just put Narbox test. And now we can see if it's actually there in the devices list where we put it. Now things get a little bit tricky when you want to add something to an already existing folder or you want to make a folder inside of a folder. Now for now that's a workaround, so I'm just going to show you here on screen for example if you want to do a subfolder this is what you have to do, you use a slash or if you just want to add something to an already existing folder you just merge it together. Now I talked a little bit with the team about this and they ensured me that in the next version this will be a lot easier. So a few thoughts on this thing and on the new feature that comes with it, the file management. I think it's really dope. As I said you before, the, the last feature, the batch export, is also really cool and it helps so much with all of the stuff you do. I'm not worrying about taking my laptop with me anymore if I'm going out on a shoot. I just take this thing, make sure I have a couple of hard drives on there and I'm good to go. Plus, if you are a user of the Narbox, you already have one, go to the Narbox page and I'm gonna link it down in the description below. They have some do's and don'ts which you shouldn't do and which you should do when using this feature. Also the rate at which these, these updates are coming out. They're just killing it. Guys at Narbox, thank you for us backers. Thank you for us Narbox users. And for all of you peeps, yes, you there. If you have a question, just put it in the description below. And I will see you in the next one. Stay creative, inspire yourself.